State police and the Coast Guard spent the night searching for a man who a witness reported fell through the ice on the Detroit River. The witness says the man walked out onto the ice just after 5 p.m. and then started jumping up and down until he fell through. It happened near the bridge to Belle Isle. Coast Guard crews conducted a search of the river but were unable to find anything. A former Hazel Park police detective accused of embezzling $68,000 while on the job is going to face a judge tomorrow morning. 45-year-old Sean Boucher accused of taking the forfeiture funds for his own personal use between 2013 and 2017. Today, turned himself into state police after being charged with several felonies, including conducting a criminal enterprise and embezzlement. Faces up to 20 years in prison if convicted. He'll be arraigned tomorrow at 10 a.m. An orange barrel alert for anyone headed to Detroit this weekend. Demolition work requires closing both directions of I-94 between I-75 and Connor Avenue. That starts Friday night. MDOT is replacing the Frontiac Street overpass. The new bridge will replace the current structure that was built back in 1954. All lanes on I-94 are expected to reopen by 5 Monday morning.